family and friends. Today I'm going to be making goulash. And I already have, I got some little steak meats off in there. Some little steak meat that I uh, already pre-cooked. But now I'm just to add my, my onions and my um, jalapeno and bell pepper. I'm going to let those cook first. Can you hear me know those onions? Onions? Yeah. I'm going to let this cook in just a little before I add my ground beef. <coughs> Ooh, I'm so happy. And um, I used to eat this when I was little. My mom used to make this. But I'm just making a twist of a, a different twist on it. Um, I'm going to be adding, I'm going to add some seasoning off in here. I'm going to be, instead of <coughs> just ground beef, I'm adding beef tips too. My mom just used to make it with ground beef. And I can't remember if she added cheese off in there, but I'm going to add some cheese off in there. I'm going to add some Velveeta cheese off in there. And plus, this is the first time we're tasting it. And I never made this, so this is my first time making it. Because I just used to eat it because my mom made it. So I'm going to use her dish for give it a twist and make it mine. Can we tell Grandma? <laughs> yeah. Okay. Hey, Grandma, look what Mommy cooked. You sent a picture on Facebook. Okay, I'm just going to let that cook down just a little. And go. Okay, I just have my ground beef off here and I'm just going to break it up. This, by the way, this smells really, really good. Yeah, work those muscles. And out in here, you can basically add whatever meat you want. I'm going to do uh, ground beef and beef tips. And you can, um, next time I'll probably try with chicken. I don't know. Because I love trying making new dishes and stuff. And we like eating it. Well, at least and I my do. family likes eating what I cook because I love to cook. That's one of the things that I love to do besides running my candle business. And by the way, if y'all want to buy some candles from me, just go down to the bottom of the um, description and I have my link there in my store where y'all can um, buy candles. And I have a lot more. I have a variety of stuff like air freshener, wax nails and stuff like that that you can order too. That smells really good, Mama. Thank you. It would taste better in my mouth. What's your little get The one that was on the bed? Already oh, open? Yeah. Okay. Okay, I'm gonna add me some mush garlic off in there. Dog, that's not yours. And this is actually called um, Texas. What did I call it? Um, I don't forget what it is. Goulash. This is called. This is actually the you Texas one. Going to take they have different kinds. Hey, cut it out. Okay. And go. Okay, I have to pause it because I have to yell at my kids very quick. Because they're making a lot of noise while I'm trying to make a video. Okay, so um, this is called a Texas, the uh, American way to make it. They have other kinds of ways, which I can't wait to try the different other kinds of ways. Turn off the one. But I'm making a text the um, American way. And I will be trying other people's recipe too to see how um, it turns out. Okay, so I did add my garlic up in there. I just added, let me add. One more half a spoon. I'm adding one more half a spoon. Pork off in there. It tastes good by itself. That's looking good. Um. <coughs> um, Jenny, can you give me the so I can turn this piece off? Because I don't like these. 
Okay, the first thing I'm going to do is drain this grease off and then I'll be back for the next step. And go. So I'm going to add my diced tomatoes up in there. Looking good, looking good. And then <coughs> I'm going to add my tomato paste in. Ooh, me want to look out of that. I'm making a large pot, so I'm going to use a little bit extra. You're just going to give that a good mix. That tastes good. Thank you. No, come back. Mama's going to get some water. Right? Yeah. To put in the pot. So, yeah. So I got my cup of water. And I got my tomato sauce. I'm just going to pour half of this off in there. And the rest of water. I'm just going to give it a stir. And then I'm going to put my water off in there. I put half of the water off in there. So it looks like this. So now I'm just going to let this cook down a little. And then I'll be back to add my noodles. You get it? <laughs> my noodles off in there, but before I do that, I'm going to season it, because we want to season it for taste. And the only two seasoning I really use is garlic salt and seasoning of salt. I don't use black pepper because I'm allergic to it, so I don't buy black pepper at all. So, this is how it looks so far. It looks really good, and I'm just gonna let that cook down a little. There you go. Okay, so it's it's already boiling. So what I'm gonna do? I'm just gonna add the noodles up in. And I'm just gonna let this cook off in there. I'm gonna let it cook for. 15 minutes and then I'm gonna check it and then I'm gonna let one of the kids taste it and tell me if the noodle is ready so they like it and then that'll be it. <coughs> Would you stop? And we're gonna use all of it because they like to eat so we just use the whole box of it. And I'm just gonna let this do it. You have to let it boil before you stick the noodles off in there. So it has to be boiling before the noodles go off in there. So give me 10 to 15 minutes and then I'll be back. Go. Okay, um, I had to change pot because it was too much. I actually made a lot more than I expected. So this is how it looks. I'm going to show y'all. Trina, can you come over here and look up in the pot? Get over there. It is over This is how it looks. And it looks really good. But now I'm just going to add some cheese off in it. Vanilla. Wait, that's it. Wait, wait. Valvita. Valvita. Junior, your nose is poking me in the freaking eye. Huh? His nose come poking poke, poke me in the eye. Why are you going to be here? Leave my nose alone. I'm just going to get out of stare. I'm just basically going to take it out. 
<coughs> For a second, I thought you were gonna pour the whole bag in it. I know. Oh. Oh. Okay. I was right. Oh, that smells so divine. Dang, mommy. This really smells good, y'all. I'm surprised you got haven't got your own cooking show yet. Aww, that's so sweet. You got a candle shop. Saying. You got a candle shop. You do all kinds of candles, different stuff, dispensers okay, and all so that. Okay, I got my cheese off in there, and I'm gonna let it cook just a little bit more. But I wanna add a little. Oh, if y'all hear that that buzzing sound, that's a fan. So please don't pay no attention to that. And now I'm just going to add a little mild cheddar. Just a little, not as much as that. Ooh, cheesy. I'm going to mix. You got to take a one? Yeah. Yes. So I'm just going to melt it down. I'll see you. Ooh, Look how... Pretty that is. Yeah. I bet you taste good too. I bet it smells good too. Okay, so I'm just to get ready to make the plate. Go. Okay, so I'm just gonna put it on my plate. Oh look, that looks so good. And here is how here is how it looks. I taste it. Wow, Mama. Scared so, of you. So if you like this video, please give me a thumbs up and subscribe at the bottom. Bye. Bye.